Hello and welcome to my presentation about OpenSUSE on the mainframe. I am Sarah Kriesch. Many of you know me as the translation coordinator in the past. Last year I have changed to the S390X port as a maintainer and member of the release engineering team. I will tell you something about the future of community distributions on IBM C because we have achieved a lot in the last year. Uh, and our agenda is for at first uh, about mainframes and the S390X architecture. What is that? Then we will come to open through the tumbleweed for S390X. That uh, is a little bit about the history and what is going on. When we come to the important topic, open through the leap 15.3 for S390X, that is the first stable release for C, uh, uh, C architecture uh, uh, by us. Then we will come to containers for S390X, what we are doing there and what uh, do we want to achieve there. And that is an important topic for coming uh, to the future of community distributions. Our plan here and uh, uh, what we want to achieve in the future. A mainframe is a large high performance computer system. Some people are, uh, are calling that big endians and that is used for mission critical applications. Banks are using uh, such uh, sy systems as uh, examples and thousands of VMs can run on uh, one system. On the right side, you can see uh, 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 such an um, uh, IBM, IBM uh, uh, a system with the name Linux One. That is a, a special uh, a mainframe with Linux configurations uh, 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 and uh, uh, it comes from the IBM C series. Therefore, there exists uh, the uh, uh, IBM C and the Linux One, which is only uh, uh, the same for uh, Linux systems. Such systems exist since 1964. And then we will uh, come to the uh, history of the S390X architecture. S390X is the architecture for IBM C and Linux One. The first IBM mainframe system was the ES9000 in the, uh, and that was introduced in 1990. Then uh, IBM has changed the name to System S390 in the middle of 1990. That was the IBM 3090 system, so you can see that a little bit in the architecture name uh, with the uh, system history. That uh, was specified for the 32-bit architecture. And afterwards, uh, they said uh, we want to introduce the 64-bit architecture. We add the X at the end. So the 64-bit architecture for the mainframe is the S390X and that has been introduced in the uh, 2000 years. OpenSUSE uh, open is a part of the uh, uh, C Linux uh, 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 family and there exists other uh, special uh, operating systems for IBM C. There are COS, CVSE, CTPF and CVM. CVM can be used for uh, Linux too. There is another virtual machine system uh, parallel to KVM on uh, the C architecture. Then we come to C Linux. There are multiple runnable Linux distributions for IBM C and Linux One. You can see all the runnable Linux distributions uh, there. Enterprise distributions are uh, SUSE Linux Enterprise, Red Hat Enterprise Linux and Ubuntu. 
and uh, the communities uh, as we are doing uh, that are creating uh, uh, their Linux distributions for S390X2 uh, and there are OpenSUSE, Fedora, Debian and Alpine Linux. OpenSUSE Tumbleweed exists for S390X since 2016. Berthold Gunreben has announced that in the past and that is a good choice for development on mainframes for the future because of all the latest packages and that you can uh, that uh, and Tumbleweed is a good choice for development. So we would recommend that for the development in the future. Afterwards, I, we have to say since this year we have got uh, our uh, first stable release, OpenSUSE Leap 15.3 for S390X. Yeah, so uh, 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 you can uh, run uh, servers and everything else with a stable base. Uh, and you can, uh, 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 we have got the possibility to use uh, the Linux One Community Cloud uh, uh, with OpenSUSE because you can uh, change from SLES to OpenSUSE then. Uh, you need only to upgrade uh, uh, your VM then. Then we uh, uh, will come to the future with containers on IBM C. You can see all the uh, 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 technologies here. We have got Podman, Docker, Kubernetes, our own uh, 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 OpenSUSE Cubic symbol and Rancher. Most uh, uh, base things as Docker, Podman and Kubernetes are running here on uh, IBM C systems uh, as, as since some years and we want to continue that with our S390X port too. One example uh, is OpenSUSE Cubic for S390X, what we want to achieve. OpenSUSE Cubic is a container platform by OpenSUSE that exists since uh, some years. Uh, we have got successful builds in uh, OBS uh, now. Our to-dos uh, uh, there are manual test deployments uh, in, envir uh, in mainframe in environments where uh, it is working, so we, ne we need some volunteers who want to test it. Then we have to enable our tests in OpenQA for OpenSUSE Cubic that will, uh, will receive uh, automated tests. But we will come to an important topic now. What is uh, with container images for S390X? As a base, we can use OpenSUSE Cubic. So we have got OpenSUSE as a base and Kub uh, uh, OpenSUSE Cubic as our uh, Kubernetes platform. There is uh, a problem. Docker Hub does uh, provide only uh, a, a limit uh, uh, of uh, container images for S390X because uh, we were not uh, allowed to publish our container images uh, uh, to uh, uh, co public container registries. What exists besides of that? There is uh, Cray.io by Red Hat. IBM is uh, working together with Red Hat uh, with OpenShift. So there are uh, uh, some uh, container images for S390X, but that is not public. Therefore, we thought about uh, uh, our solution that uh, our users uh, can use container images for S390X. There is a possibility to use uh, open uh, SUSE container images uh, created by us. 
We have got registry.opensuse.org. That is a container registry by OpenSUSE and we provide multi arch container images. On this way, her OBS is building continuously her container images based on OpenSUSE Tumbleweed. It is planned to do that for OpenSUSE Leap in, in, in uh, the coming year too. So we can provide OpenSUSE Tumbleweed uh, images and in the future OpenSUSE uh, Leap based images. Here you can see uh, the uh, GitHub repository for our container images. Our plan is that we work together with our companies uh, and uh, create our own uh, container uh, images so you can use all container platforms uh, 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 with public container images for S390X at the end. We will work together with the other uh, architectures as ARM uh, and uh, Power People uh, and X86 uh, People uh, that we create multi arch container images. Afterwards, we want, uh, uh, my plan is that we will work together with the other uh, 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 Linux communities so we can uh, pub, uh, uh, so that we will have got a future uh, in the IBM C world. Let's build our own images, I can only say. Take a VM in the Linux One Community Cloud, install uh, Docker, Docker, and adapt existing x86 container images with OpenSUSE, replace the base image, add the uh, zipper commands instead of the other things, and test them with the Docker build command. What uh, you what will happen then? You will have uh, situations to receive illegal instructions. Replace these uh, uh, com uh, uh, hidden commands with alternative commands, and test it afterwards on your x86 system, uh, your laptop in your case, whether it is running there too and then you can commit that. Afterwards, that will be built all in our OBS system and that will be published here in here, uh, our registry. What is our goal with the future of community distributions? We want uh, to uh, make open source more public So uh, users and customers uh, of IBM C and Linux One systems uh, can use uh, uh, Linux uh, and Kubernetes platforms for free. They are not forced to use any special product. Uh, open, uh, we, we did a good start. OpenSUSE, Fedora and Debian are running on S390X. We have got our first stable release and we can give uh, uh, our users access to open source container images. We ha have to do that. Afterwards, all free uh, Kubernetes distributions can be used on uh, mainframes and uh, uh, we as a Linux community can give the opportunity of more freedom uh, on the mainframe. The collaboration uh, is possible. Uh, uh, we are speaking uh, uh, with uh, uh, pa possible partners, but we can achieve that. Then at the end, here are the data about our S390X port team. You can find us in the OpenSUSE wiki 
her under C systems. We have got our her own OBS project with uh, C systems. You can speak with us on our mailing list and you can speak up with us here on Libera Chat under Open SUSE C Systems. Let's come to the Q&A session.